Grand Prix, the World Grand Prix, the Prix itself just makes you feel like it has a world. That's what get it? Feel like you stay there. Rough crowd. So anyway, welcome back to Cars Jaden, and today we're gonna be reviewing two energetic cars that I have not been opened yet. And I just want to show you this collection of, like, World Grand Prix cars, and the Cars 3, Cars 2 cars, stuff like that. Here's my very first car for real. It's part of later. Finn McMissile for Cars 2. It's my very first Cars 2 with car. I let Finn get the rest. Maybe because I was, like, too young to understand the meaning of cars. I had a bit, another one like this, but I lost it. I don't want to really explain how, but I just lost it and it, I never found it again. So then I had to get another one, and it's really, I haven't lost any other cars ever since, as far as I can remember. So anyway, today we're going to be reviewing the Cars 2 flag waiver. And the cars to security guard. And this might seem like a random review for a security guard, but actually, if you guys have seen some of my older reviews, I reviewed Marlon Clutches McKay, which is also Cars 1 security guard. So I don't know what Cars 3 security guards look like, but they ought to look really cool. If we ever get car streets, like anything, we haven't got any pities. Oh, I'm not talking about Guido, including. We haven't even gotten like a t t car street team, not even next gens, not even crew chiefs, not even a thing. I'm just trying to improvise here. I know there's no like. I don't think there's any pace cars. But just for the fun, I just, br I just brought the two pace cars just for the show. So without further ado, let's get this car opened up. These two cars actually opened up. I have to tell you guys something. I want to show you the card back of the card. So back here we have the, like the the pity, the toolbox, and the crew chief of the rules the rules, and the same thing for Rupkus Kuskonski, whatever, or Kuskonski. But. There's something I should tell you guys. I'm not sure anyone, if if I'm not supposed to tell anyone about this, but I've been on like this. Re I heard this Nintendo thing about this weird community, and I was on it, but I, it was more like it wasn't like it was more older, but then it just got canceled due to Google troubles, so they had to get off that and make another account. And on that, I real I saw something that caught my eye. I saw a five pack of the next of the next Lucas car, the Lucas next gen. And just to give you context of who the other fuck four are, Rusty's Lightning McQueen, Jackson Storm, Danny Suarez, Chase Racelet. That's pretty much it. And I and there was also an eleven pack with Barry the Pedal, cool one. Cam Spinner, Chase Racelet, I don't know, I, I just know that, and the packaging, the backs of the car, of the pop boxes and stuff, looked really different, I mean they were like, more like, if you guys seen Ice Age you would understand, it, ha it had like a 
random background of Ice Age, and it looked really weird. There's also a, a couple more two packs, um, including the two new trainers, like Ronald from Car Street, and I don't know who the other car is at the moment, but you get the picture. These two particular cars are going to be in that packaging for the future, so I don't know, maybe, maybe not, maybe it's just a prank or something, but one of the, like, one of the particular people said that there was, like, that the five pack was in U.S. Walmarts, or, well, they're saying, well, the guy said that he was there being found at, at Walmarts, at U.S. Walmarts, anyway. So, here are the two cars at, and I don't really know what, what to do first. Should I start with the obvious choice, the flag waver, or the security guard? I'm just going to go for a flag waiver. So, first thing I want to talk about is the flag. This is going to be the future of flag waivers from now on. I'm betting my money on it. I mean, it looks more detailed. I mean, the old Cars 2 and 1 have like a hole kind of like around here that pokes through like for the flag. So it went like through its like body. That was disgusting really unsanitary but the wheels anyway they're really awesome and yes this is not attached this is movable for real and they should do this for like Dexter Huber and Chris Chris Krzyzewski so anyway I like the World Grand Prix logo it's really random and I don't know what kind of, like, like, look he has. He looks like a weird, like, minivan model. But yet again, I don't know. Maybe it's just me that I don't know. But anyway, I like his expression. Tylen eyes. They're just less obvious. Because they don't, they're just mostly flat. And I like the smile on it, even though it's less, like, like, literally not realistic. Well, it's kind of realistic or something. Well, I can't read the logo right now. Maybe I can read it off camera. It's some random logo for some company. If you guys have this, the new Thailand one, you can, if you can tell this, Please leave it in the comments, because I don't remember right now. I like the lights that are connected to the logo, stuff like that. Anyway, I like the side, World Grand Prix, the logo again. The top is just regular white, like the gas cap. The back mirror lights have a good tint to it. Same logo from back in front of here. Can't read that. Still can't read that. I'm gonna push that aside. Let's get to the security guard. Now, right here, he looks amazing. The headsets on these cars have. This guy has a little more, a little more detail around here really awesome it looks more like a metal like plastic like it's connected there it's not like done he really looks like from the cars 2 movie i thought there was like a like a different car like a pace car but no he just went with security guard for this yet again same thing for the eye plate there's no eye plate on this thing whatsoever i guess that's for the good I like its look. Let me take a good look at it. It's so small in there, I can't read it. But anyway, the, the lights look like it's a police officer. While this looks like the security part looks like he's just... Yeah, he looks half police, 
have security. And I like this bet. Now I only have like five minutes to do this, not because of time spanning, but because I that's how much I have put on this. Because not five minutes in general, just fifteen. So I'm just gonna get through this review super fast because I was only on the packaging, explaining what's going to be, what is going on, stuff like that. They're just good sweet stuff. So I'm just gonna bring out a few couple of random models that I found. I might have. Here we are. I think this suits. Yeah, it looks really, really close. Here's another mini. It doesn't completely look like him or her. I don't really know. Maybe it's a he. It doesn't really look like him, but it, it's kind of close too. Now let me break some more examples for this guy. Show more and Van. Don't know this girl's name much. Super. The van is just a little bigger than 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 the security guy. And keel, the same thing, but I can tell that it has a has it's kind of the same. Same for like the flag wave, where it's not completely the same, but it it works. It kind of fits the models, kind of like this. But yeah, that's the review of two new cars. Now, and you'll be and you can be expecting some like five more reviews near future because soon enough I'll be getting like a 10 pack that that um, contains with one car I want to get in that pack with five I can ex five, four more I can accept and you know I'm not even gonna leave it till tomorrow or like like next day or let's say Wednesday it's expected to come Wednesday, but I'm, but sometimes, like most of the time, there's just one time I got like a train that's really odd for me. But if you haven't seen my Thomas, like short Thomas stuff, couple Thomas stuff, I made a lot of view videos on that. Like some of it is while Thomas is going around, like to like place like that, and you get the picture. So I got that a day before I was supposed to, I was expected to get that. Then I ordered like two new two more cars out of that. Like Terry Cargas, five pack. And oh and can't forget like the Frogman. Or like Ed Tronkin or something. And now here I am getting the the Dan the let me just say, the Dan Carcia 10 pack, sooner or later. So, soon enough, I'll be getting that 10 pack and I'll be reviewing all the cars in the K in that 10 pack. And, I'm, and just to make you clear, I am going to be showing the packaging for each car I get that has a different look to it. So yeah, that's cool. Get cool for that. More reviews. Or are you excited to see the rest of the season five? And I am gonna save, gonna keep Darren Leftwood in the season just because I have so much other stuff to look forward to for season five. I may like end it off with Darren getting replaced, and also with like. I hate to put this in, but I'm afraid Rex too. Maybe like in season in episode 13 of this season. But you'll you'll see on the way. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been a wonderful journey for me, and I'll see you guys in the next video or review. You don't know. Anyway, goodbye. See you, YouTubers.